Hey, what's up? This is Dave Hansen, and welcome to Behind the Head. Welcome to Behind the Athlete. Today, I have one of the most impressive men's volleyball players with me, Ian Carbonier. Ian plays opposite hitter and had such an excellent season last year, and he won the 2010 MIVA Freshman of the Year Award. Tell us about what that meant to you, and how you would like to build on that achievement in the spring. I was very honored to be the MIVA Freshman of the Year last year. Um, going into last year, I expected to redshirt and didn't even expect to get to play at all. And um, being able to play and even start last year was uh, was so much fun and a great experience. And uh, I'm glad that I could get recognized by the other coaches in the conference uh, for all the hard work that I put in. Okay, congratulations on that once again. What did you think about the fairness of your team being ranked 14th overall in the ABCA preseason poll? I think it's a great ranking for us, considering that we lost several key players last year and that we're going to be so young this year. Um, it's, it's good to see that uh, the other coaches recognize that we are, are growing our program and that we are going to be a team to contend with for the next few years. You guys, you guys potentials can only go up. What is your favorite song or artist to listen to before games? Actually, uh, even though not many people like country music, I would have to say that Kenny Chesney is my favorite artist to listen to, regardless of whether I'm warming up or just relaxing. I'm quite a country fan myself. If there was one thing you could change about Lewis, what would it be? I would say that um, the, the, uh, the campus does a great job of, of keeping a good image. And I, I see all too often people just uh, kind of throwing things on the ground and, and not taking care of, of the campus, which is where we live and where we go to school. And I take a lot of pride in, uh, in aesthetics, and I think they do a great job of keeping this campus looking nice. And I think this, the student body uh, could do a better job of helping to uh, keep up our appearance here on campus. Nice school, this is. And what is the biggest difference between this season and your last? Um, this season, I think our our team is even uh, our team is even closer. Uh, we're all we're all great friends, and we all like each other, and we get along great. And um, we're really starting to uh, find our rhythm uh, on the court because of that. And uh, it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be a fun year. What is your one biggest individual goal this season? My biggest goal is to be a. Uh, uh, first team all-conference player this year and to uh, improve on uh, what I've done last year. It's a big goal. Where would you say the confidence of your team is after their, their best start since the 2007 season? I think our, our confidence is very high. We're looking, uh, we're, I feel, we feel good, we're playing well, and uh, we're very confident going into this next weekend. We've got uh, two, two pretty big weekends coming up uh, playing uh, Penn State and Stanford. Outside of your matchup against Sanford, though, which game are you looking forward to the most? I would say the the home match against Ohio State. Uh, it's one of our biggest rivals, and uh, it's a conference game on top of that. So it's going to be very important for our MIVA standings, and I just never want to lose to Ohio State at home, <laughs> for sure. If you could play for any other team in the country, who would it be and why? If I had to pick another team to play for... I think it would be um, probably Pepperdine, I would say, if I had to pick another school to go to, because they have, uh, the West Coast has such a, such a great volleyball atmosphere, the competition, they're playing at a high level every day, and um, I went on a visit there, and it is one of the most beautiful campuses I've ever seen, uh, right in the mountains on the edge of the ocean, it would be, it would be fun to go to school there. Definitely sounds nice. And finally, a question everyone's wanting to know. Who will win the Super Bowl this year? Steelers or the Packers? Hmm. I'm going to have to go with the Packers. I think that uh, Aaron Rodgers is playing some good football. He definitely played some good football yesterday against the Bears. Thanks so much for your time, Ian. I'd like to wish you and the rest of your volleyball teammates the best of luck this season. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see everybody next time.